Hello, I'm going to show you how to upload a video onto YouTube. Up, um, to upload a video, basically all you have to do is go into your, um, you have to set up um, a free account for us, it's 100% free. Um, you set up a channel. Now what happens is, click on upload up here. And uh, you'll have to be signed into your account to do this, because it uploads onto um, your channel. Click on upload video, which is the yellow button, and these are all your videos. So basically, you just click on whichever one you want. Um, videos here, and all your videos come up here. You basically just click on it, and you type in what you want, and that's how you bring it up. Now I prefer to use something like um, Windows Movie Maker. I have um, Windows Seven currently working on my computer, so therefore. Uh, my Windows Live Movie Maker might be slightly different to the look than yours. This is what mine looks like anyway. And um, basically, what the reason why I like to do this is um, you can add in different things like transitions and all that kind of effects on yours. So all you have to do is, um, I'll move this and you can see, open uh, Windows Movie Maker, which is right there. So basically just um, open that, um, I'll open it there, now, uh, this all you do, you go up here and click on um, add videos and photos, just uh, here, and then all your videos and all that kind of stuff will come up here, these are just ones I uploaded from my camcorder. Um, I'm going to bring up something here now. Documents. And uh, there we go. Now, this is um, a video I made about how to make um, a CD cover in Photoshop. Now, my video comes up like this. So, I'm going to add a title here. And I'm going to say how. Um, to make a video in in Photoshop, and I'm going to put in brackets CS3. Uh, sorry, I mistake away that question mark. Now, Windows Movie Maker is a very easy thing to use. You can. Uh, change the amount of time that is there you can change the font type select it all there uh, change the color change that change that see the way you do all of that basically you're doing all from the uh, font section along here I'm going to change the type of the font see the way I did that you basically come up here and you can do it all of that um, now I'm going to that now I want to uh, add another title here and I'm going to say and Andrew Mac production in case you're wondering why um why I wrote this that's just my YouTube name that's my YouTube username, so therefore my account would be on um, youtube.com forward slash Andrew Mackin official. So, uh, what happens now is you can basically do stuff like editing bits out by clicking on um, edit. You can split it in parts, add in other stuff, trim tool for um, taking parts out. You can do like the noise, fade in, fade out, all that kind of stuff. So it's absolutely brilliant thing to use. Um, you have to, well, like um, to upload something onto the YouTube. Then afterwards, like you'll have to be connected to the internet, but um, you don't for this. Now, that's um, basically just my video there. So I'm going to click um, credits up here, and I can add in credits there. I'm going to say um. Uh, Thank you for 
for watching the please subscribe to my videos and I'm going to add in then one more at the very end I'm going to click up on credits again there we go and I'm going to um, get rid of that and I'm going to type in the end now you don't want, you don't really want something just plain looking like that because that won't look that great I mean like when you watch a movie on TV where it says the end it's always going to be big and cool writing and all that kind of stuff so we're going to do something like that um, now I'm just going to basically Now, there we go. So, um, I'm going to do that there at the end. Select that. I'm going to type in up at the top. When you uh, click the arrow down to see all the fonts, the highest font is 72. And that doesn't really come that big when you do this. So therefore, what you want to do is, like if you want a big font, basically you're going to have to come up here and we're in the font part where it says 72, or whatever number it says, type in here, 1, 1, not, 110, and then click enter. And then it comes up a lot bigger. Now, what you do then is, you have to select it. Uh, come up here and click on um, italic to make it all like that then you click on the font type and you come down along here now I'd recommend Edwardian's um, script it's right above engraver SMT just click on that and that's what that looks like um, basically that's all you need to do there now I've got to change the type of that there we go and um, I'm going to change the part of the screen that it comes on and then these are all your transitions up here you can do stuff like coming in like that coming in like that coming in like that in like that in like that come on up then like that in like that in like that things like that so you can do them all I just prefer to use this one so then at the very end of your video it should come up like this. So here we go now. This is the very end of your video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my videos. And then the end. And that's basically all you have to do there. Now, when you're done that, you can either choose to burn it to a DVD. So you click on the DVD there. You can watch on um, the TV on in high definition. Now what you do here to upload it onto YouTube is click on the YouTube button here. As you can see. Now if it doesn't come up in the top row there, click on the arrow going down and you'll eventually find it. So here we are, YouTube. Now you're going to have to sign into your YouTube account to do this. So basically you wait for that to come up. It could take a few minutes but you just sign in there. You type in your username and password and you click sign in. Um, you give it a title. How to make a video in Photoshop. And I'm going to put in brackets CS3. Now, description. Um, Showing you. Oh, no, sorry, wait now. C D cover. Now showing you how to make a C D. It 
and check them up there. Now you have to choose tags and that, so I'm going to use for Photoshop CS3 as a tag. I'm also going to use um, CD. I'm going to use cover. I'm going to use um, um, Okay, I'll leave it with that. Now you select the category. So I'm going to say um, how to and style. It should be in that. Okay. Now click publish then, which is at the bottom of the screen. And you just wait for it to save your movie. That should go up pretty quickly. And um, basically, I don't have much time left here. I only have three minutes left um, of time, and that might take a bit longer uh, before I waste out of time for the video. You only have um, 15 minutes just to let you know of video time. Um, I'm on to 11 minutes now, so I better wrap up. Um, I'm on my, um, my channel here. As you can see, I've had... Uh, I've 21 channel views and all and I've only uploaded one video so far and it only went up um, yesterday and it's already got 45 views it's only 12 o'clock um, here in the evening and I only put the video up at half six yesterday evening and it's already got uh, 45 views as you can see there now I'll just see if this is done uploading there no it's not that could be a while now basically what you do when it's done is It'll come up here, but when you search for it in um, YouTube, I'll show you now what I mean. I'll just sign out there. When you search for it in uh, this box up here in YouTube, whatever you named your video, I'll just show you now. Um, I, I, I'm saving... Um, uh, how to make a CD cover in Photoshop. Now when I search that, that's not going to come up. That video that I just put up there won't come up. Because um, it's not fully onto it. You have to wait 20 to 30 minutes before it's fully on. And then it should come up there. Thank you very much for watching. Um, please subscribe to my videos. Thank you very much. Goodbye.